Hey Taurus, this is Soul, uh, Intuitive uh, Tarot for Unique Souls. Welcome to my channel. Taurus, this is going to be your general weekly focus reading for the week of uh, March 14th through the 16th, 2016. Uh, before I begin your reading, Taurus, I do want to express that uh, the messages that come forth will resonate with some of you, but not all of you. The overall energy that I'm feeling for some Taurus is uh, for this upcoming week relate to uh, the Two of Wands energy uh, that's in the reverse. So there's a situation well situations because there's a couple of messages attached to this two of wands showing up in the reverse so this is not a good week um to try to put out any um you know projects uh creative projects uh wait until the following week to see if the energy shifts also to the, related to a relationship there is a taurus that I'm reading for is having a um, possibly difficult time with a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, male or female. Uh, this energy that I'm sensing coming up, but I feel because it is the start of your energy, I'm picking up past energy that you could be a Taurus is in a relationship or dating someone who is a fire sign and this person is being um, not overly difficult but somewhat difficult um <clears throat> but i don't think it's anything that you need to stress over or worry about i just feel that they're just you know being a little complicated also the formation of ideals um someone you may have abandoned some sort of ideas uh related to a project or at least it will be abandoned this uh, upcoming week. So again, the emphasis is not to um, put your creative uh, ideals or your work out there because I don't feel this is a good week for you. And then also there's an abandonment of any ideal or creative projects uh, for some of you. Someone's dealing with a difficult fire sign, uh, but I don't see anything uh, that you need to stress or worry about. I think it's just uh, this person... It's coming across a little uh, possibly hot tempered. Two of Wands. Also, I feel that some Tauruses that I'm reading for this upcoming week, uh, you'll feel less driven, motivated. Uh, but it's not significant. It's just, you know, maybe just a decrease of energy uh, that you f you're feeling. Or you may just be, you know, get that feeling of being overworked or just don't have that damn energy. You know what I mean? But by the end of the week, you will pick up. It's not something that will stay with you. I just feel that it may just occur during the start of the week. Anyway, I'm not going to spend too much time on that two of wands, but <laughs> moving right along, Taurus, we have the um, four of wands now <laughs> in the reverse position yesterday going back to. Two weeks since this is a mini week now this is where i'm getting that message about some of you are dealing or either dating a fire sign or in a relationship with a fire sign now we have the four of wands in the reverse in the passing uh recent past energy so it's in the reverse so that means there's some sort of unsettling issue going on uh related to some sort of domestic stuff going on related to uh relationships Possibly with a fire sign. Some sort of unsettling shit going on. Uh, also too I feel with. The recent past of this four wands showing up. Some of you may have been looking to relocate. Uh, possibly move to another area. Or you know. Apartment. Condo. Um, something to do with. A home. Maybe there was something that happened. If you weren't looking for a home condo or apartment possibly a townhouse then there was something going on in that home and i'm i'm seeing that there may have been some sort of problem related to the home itself and unrelated to any uh i do still see the domestic unsettling stuff but it may be something that happened in the home uh that was beyond your control that was unsettling to you so i'm just getting the two week yesterday going back to two week energy okay something happened in somebody's home apartment townhomes townhouse that was unsettling so it could have been something as simple as uh, uh a 
okay, a small fire, possibly at the in the cooking area, the kitchen, and then something to do with water. Maybe a water pipe broke or something. Something to do with fire and water. <laughs> wow, I'm getting that for the four of wands uh, in the reverse. All right, so that's your recent past, and then it's passing you. So either you you know it's happened and you're overcoming it. So it's in the reverse. So you're overcoming whatever took place that was unsettling related to either domestic disharmony or something going on physical uh, structure with the home. Okay, middle of the week. Uh, now we have the nine of wands, uh, Taurus, and it's uh, in the reverse. And I like this nine of wands in the middle of the week because it's overcoming battles and struggles uh, with the nine of wands always represents battles and struggles uh, from external sources, uh, interferences from family and friends, uh, possibly getting involved in your personal affairs. Uh, if it's a romantic or intimate relationship, that's what I speak of. Uh, and it could be. Uh, overcoming some battles and struggles related to family issues, structure, co-workers. Some Tauruses may have felt like they were attacked physically uh, in the recent past. And now it's an overcoming of that energy. It's a lessening or a degree of that energy of dealing with people who are creating problems for you. And then I also feel internally for some Tauruses is uh, weaning down in, you know, personal struggles and battles. So whatever that means and whatever is going on in your life that's close or significant to you, that's the message for you. So it's not really bad. It's just a weaning down or lessening of that energy related to either internal battles and struggles and definitely outside influence and external influences from others. All right. So the tail end of your reading, Taurus, we have the sun, major arcana, major life events. So the sun is all about Taurus is enjoying at the end of the week, whatever they endured during the beginning of the week. <clears throat> At the end of the week, I'm seeing a lot of happiness and joy, uh, feeling like, you know, you're childlike. Also, too, that sun represents for me that some Tauruses have either some sort of medical issue going on. And, and I see uh, hospital visits and uh, medical appointments, some exposure to radiation. <clears throat> radiation could be, you know, something as simple as uh, uh, X-ray but also could extend out to uh, chemo. Something to do with uh, possible chemo treatments. Being exposed to radiation, chemo, hospital visits, doctor's appointments. And then also, too, uh, there could be a, a situation for the Leos who have children. There might be a doctor's appointment or uh, a, ch a child visits to the hospital okay it's in the upright so i see that whatever the situation is uh it turns out to be positive so just keep that in mind and it's really a happy card it's, it's really a good energy card so i see that whatever energy that you were lacking with the two of wands by the end of the week it'll start to pick up and going into the weekend <clears throat> You'll feel more energized and ready to, to take on anything. So I like that for uh, some of the Tauruses that I'm reading for. Also, too, the energy of Oracle card that finishes your reading, Taurus. So the energy of Oracle card to support your reading, I have selected patience. So for some Tauruses I'm reading for, patience is required. So whatever it is, <clears throat> if you had to deal with a situation related to um, something going on in terms of the home, uh, family structure, and it wasn't repaired so you know more patience is required for that and uh if there was any you know difficulties related to a relationship more patience is required because i just feel that the person that is creating a problem or being complicated is just having a tizzy fit okay <laughs> and it, they will overcome it so whatever it is and also the lessening of the energy of internal uh, battles and struggles to have more patience to allow that energy to completely leave you and the weaning down 
uh, personal interference. Just have more patience that the people will leave you alone. All right. So there is the emphasis of um, some Taurus is having to have patience this week. And also the patience for me represents uh, possible you know balance as well so trying to balance everything out in spite of everything that you may endure this upcoming week but i do feel at the tail end of the week you will have or some will and enjoy um feeling happy and uh good about themselves um going into the weekend so that's your reading taurus uh, for the week of march 14th through the 20th 2016 uh, once again i want to thank you for uh, visiting my channel i do want to wish you all a very safe upcoming week ahead until the next time i wish you all love and light take care bye